Known for its whitewater rafting and scenic views, New River Gorge National Park is one of West Virginia's major destinations. With the New River that meanders through the area, there are over 70,000 acres of mountainous land in the park. The park is also less than a day's drive from over half of the U.S. population. The New River headwaters are located in the northwestern corner of North Carolina, and it winds north through Virginia and West Virginia. The water from the river joins up with the Ohio River, then the Mississippi River, and eventually flows into the Gulf of Mexico. The most popular spot in the park is the New River Gorge Bridge. At 876 feet high and 3,000 feet long, it is the third highest bridge in the U.S. And it's the longest single-span arch bridge in the Western Hemisphere. New River Gorge Bridge took three years to complete, and it was finished in 1978. It is made of core 10 steel. Because of the qualities of this kind of steel, they don't have to paint it. New River Bridge also has its own holiday. Bridge Day, which began in 1980. On this day, the bridge is open to pedestrians, and it's a time for base jumping, rappelling, and more. Here we are at New River Gorge, and we've been hiking here for a couple hours now, and we just made it underneath the bridge, so it looks pretty awesome. The basic structure of this bridge can be dated back to ancient Greece and the Roman Empire. The Romans built over a thousand arch bridges. The arch design was used in many other aspects of architecture as well. For example, in the aqueducts, which were the passages that were used for carrying water to cities, like this one in Caesarea Maritima. Arches form the curved part of the top of the bridge. Both sides of the arch are called abutments, as seen here. Arches are often used in architecture because they are very strong. They work by transferring the weight that is placed on top of the arch to the abutments and down into the ground. That is why when you push downward on an arch, it spreads outward. Now when you place the abutments, it stays more in place. The most important part of the arch is the keystone, which is the centerpiece of the arch. It is the last piece put in place because it distributes the weight and locks the other pieces into their spot. As arches are built, they place the abutments to hold the pieces in their shape. They form the arch from the sides and build toward the center where they finally place the keystone. Arches are used a lot in architecture because of their strength, just like in New River Gorge National Park.